what the heck is SEO? SEO. It's not a four letter word, but it's a three letter one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's an acronym for search engine optimization. So uh, there's a bunch of websites on Google and we, what SEO does is optimize your website so that Google can notice it and you know, show it to other people and making sure that everything on your website is optimized to show on Google and to show the right people. Fantastic. So SEO is a big, complicated uh, mumbo jumbo of a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> I feel like uh, there's 900 questions that are all the same, but let's start with some of the more complicated things that I don't think get asked too often, but I think should be asked. So. White hat SEO and black hat SEO. I know all of our clients get emails. The higher you rank, the more spam you get with somebody saying, I could put you on page one of Google. <laughs> this tactic, which is critical to their business. How have you seen um, those questions that are coming from customers change over the last year? Well, they're beginning to understand some of the elements of, of what I do in particular, which is SEO or search engine optimization. And they, um, are certainly far more aware of what goes into it today than they were even even 10 years ago or even five years ago so you don't have to waste as much time talking about the tactics and helping them to understand the tactics you can begin to um, share with them how if we do this or we do that what kind of an impact it's going to have on their overall marketing program, which is really kind of refreshing. I mean, you still you still run in, into people where you have to provide that education. And I always tell my clients that as we have this ongoing relationship and we have these strategic sessions, you're going to learn as much as you want to about SEO. And if it ever gets to the place where you've had enough, you know, just tell me stop. And uh, because really, uh, if you want to understand, I can't download 24 years worth of information into you, you know, in one meeting, but you, you can pick up things as you go along. Just like if I'm having my uh, air conditioner replaced or a new one installed, I might be out there looking and occasionally, you know, ask a question that's on kind of the surface level just to get an idea of what, what the person's doing. But I'm certainly not going to be able to turn around and install one myself the next week, you know? Yeah, that's real. So how much is SEO evolving? Is there a point where you're like, I can I can take this course, I now know SEO and that's what I need to know. No, you're gonna have to learn every single day for the rest of your life <laughs> uh, because there's, there's changes. And I'm not saying drastic changes. Occasionally there's one that may have a large impact and there are some things that are timeless. You have to stay on top of what you, uh, what they're doing in the SEO industry.